Hello everybody and welcome back to the channel. My name is Vince from clientsforcreatives.com and today I'm going to show you how you can create the kind of like underwater audio effect or that muffled effect that everybody loves and that can be used in a lot of creative ways actually. So let's get straight into Premiere Pro. So as you can see, I have a couple clips here on my timeline and I have an audio track under it. So you can see the first one is just like a clip of the planet. The second one is basically a clip of the ocean from like a nice drone shot. And the third one is an underwater shot. So for example, if I wanted to do a video edit or like a cinematic edit where the part of the video where it's underwater or like recorded underwater is kind of like muffled or the music sounds like it's also underwater. What I can do is just uh, cut out the part of the song by pressing C on my keyboard. And uh, I'm just going to cut out the part of the song that is under this part that is like the underwater shot. And then I'm going to go into my effects tab. And then after this, you want to search for low pass. So as you can see, I have this low pass filter here and you want to drag and drop that to the part of the audio that you want to sound underwater. And as you can see, I have that right here. And here at the cutoff uh, setting, you can change kind of the sound of the underwater effect um, that you are desiring. So let's just listen to it like this. So as you can hear, it sounds really, really cool. Uh, you can play around with the cutoff number. So if I change it to whatever, like 500, it's going to sound a bit different. It's going to be even like more underwater. So maybe if you have a couple different clips, like one of them is, let's say, just near the surface of the ocean and the other one is like really down deep. You can even play around with that and make the one that's deeper, like sound even more underwater. Or you can even use this in other scenarios as well, not just with like water clips. You can use it if um, you are really like close up to something and you use this effect. So it sounds like the outside word and the, all the different noises are kind of like in the background that can really like make a big difference in your editing. So. Hope you found this useful. This is a super, super easy to use uh, sound effect and uh, I love using this one. So if you liked it, then make sure to subscribe to the channel for more tutorial videos similar to this and I will see you guys in the next one.